Angela Aiello is back with us to talk about Artini Artinian wines, and so nice to have you with us. Hi, nice to see Thank you again. Thank you. Okay, so nice to see you too. Thank you. Let's talk about Argentina and sort of their geography and uh, their terrain and how how their wines are, are produced. And you head down to South America and you have these wonderful Andes mountains. And I think that that's really where a lot of the uniqueness from Argentina comes in. You have the pure meltwater from the mountains. Mm -hmm. You have wonderful white wines. You have their superstar grape Melbeck. And you have some high altitude growing Cabernet and other wines as well. So the altitude of the mountains really helps to bring character, uniqueness, and a wonderful taste profile to the wines. So uh, we have a nice display that you've uh, you've sent us here, and uh, we're going to start off with the white. And I'm noticing, I don't know if it's just me, but I'm noticing a lot more organic wines on the market nowadays, which is nice to see. It's so exciting to see. I think, uh, you know, in Argentina specifically, they have this, this rain shadow effect by the mountains. So it's actually easier to grow sustainably for, uh, for a lot of the wineries. But this organic wine that you have in front of you mm -hmm. is made with a unique grape called Torrantes and Chardonnay, which is a grape that is actually only available um, in Argentina, it's, it's very, very unique. So there's 13 wines available um, for sale, on, on sale actually at the LCBO right now until August 15th. So these are some fabulous wines for people to dive into and save a little bit of money at the same time. Oh wow, so I'm going to uh, grab a glass here of the one we have at the front, the Fusion. Yes, mm -hmm. so, so a beautiful label, right? Mm -hmm. This is a, yes. an, un an unoaked wine, organic like you said, uh, on sale right now for $11, and it's made with a very unique grape, so a wonderful wine for Pinot Grigio lovers. Right, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a little sip here. <laughs> have a little sip, yes. Enjoy it. It's 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 very refreshing. It is right. It's a wonderful white wine. Mm -hmm. Because some people um, sometimes Chardonnays can kind of taste a little bit heavy, and not everybody loves yes. them. But um, this one definitely has a little bit more life to it for sure. Mm -hmm. No, you're absolutely right. Chardonnay is a very unique grape because it can be completely unoaked or completely oaked. So right. it has a bit of mystery to it. <laughs> it sure does. Absolutely. Okay, let's move over. We were talking about the Malbecs and explain maybe the flavor profile, obviously, more to around a Malbec grape. Yes, yeah, so I think everyone knows Melbeck from Argentina. There's two mm -hmm. Melbecks there for, for you to taste. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think we all have learned to love Melbeck from Argentina, even though it is a grape that comes from France. Mm -hmm. It's superstardom, it's Hollywoodness has been made in Argentina. And so uh, I always say, if you love a Melbeck, it's Melbeck delicious. <laughs> and the, the, the <laughs> so good. The wines that the two Melbeck you have in front of you, I, I want you to try both of them and see if you can find a favorite because okay. they're both sort of me medium body. Mm -hmm. They have a similar style, but they, their fruitiness is different. And so finding maybe which Melbeck you like the most is a great way to have a little home wine tasting with Melbeck. Yeah, actually, that's a fun idea, especially as you say, with them, with the, you know, their wines being uh, Argentinian wines being on sale right now. It's nice to kind of experiment. Let me see. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, Argentina has been making wine for 400 years. So, I mean, they, they've got a lot of experience under their belt. And many of the producers who are making Melbeck have been, you know, making Melbeck for a really long time. And so you can have a really great tasting at home with four or five different Melbecks right now. Mm -hmm. I like the uh, I like the second one here. Um, which one was that? What is that one called? Uh, the Kaiken. Oh, the Kaiken. Yes. I actually like yeah, that. Kaiken. It actually is a very, very full bodied wine for a Malbec. It tastes very full to me. Yes, okay, mm -hmm. so there's a fruity version, the Alamos, and then you've got the Kaiken, which has a little bit more oak to it, a That's little bit more like texture. It. Yeah, it's exactly. the oak side, because I'm, I'm a Cab So person, so I can, right away yes. I like that uh, that earthy oak there. So. Oh my God, amazing. <laughs> and the Cab So you have, there's one more last Cab yes. So if you have okay. time. Okay, I'm going to go way down. Sure. We have to save time, we have to cab save lover. room for the Cab, of course. <laughs> I know, especially if you're a Cab lover. So high altitude <laughs> grapes, you have to, the vines actually have to search and look for water which gives you more character and uh, uniqueness in the actual grape itself. And then to the glass, it's much different as well. So I love the prices of Argentina Cab. Like this wine is $15 and it's, wow. you know, it overperforms for its price. That's pretty good. And anybody who is a Cab Sauv lover, you know that you can pay a lot of money for, for Cab. So that is a really yep. great price point. And that wine tastes very good. Even for, Yay, even though amazing. I'm drinking it at breakfast time. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't advise that, but they are all taste really good. Thank you for coming on and giving us more information, a little bit more background. It's kind of nice to know sort of where Argentina has gone with their wines over the years. And as you say, the terrain and the geography there really adds to uh, the flavor, flavor profiles with these wines. So very good. Thank you so much. I hope you get to everybody gets to enjoy a bottle of Argentinian wine this month. <laughs> yeah, it's a great idea to go to the LCBO and pick them up now while they're on sale. Thanks, Angela Aiello. I really appreciate you coming on the show. Take care.
Thank you so much. We'll be much. back with more Morning Live right after this. Conocen la sutileza de 